So here's a question. What does a scientist look like? Are you good at science? Do you want to get better? Then maybe you should read a story. According to a study in the Journal of Educational Psychology, reading a story about a scientist can help improve your grades. But not just any scientist. Researchers at Columbia University found out how nearly 500 middle schoolers were doing in science class. Next, they had some students read and respond to a story about a famous scientist who struggled, while others read about their accomplishments. Six weeks later, they checked back. It turns out that those students who had read the stories of struggle had improved their grades over those who had read about accomplishments. Hey, good question. Maybe you're already a scientist. At first, they thought the students had adopted a growth mindset and that they now believed they could train their brain to get smarter through effort. But it turns out most students' belief about intellect hadn't changed at all. Something else was going on. Results showed that students who had read about struggle felt more connected to the scientists. And perhaps it was this emotional connection that made them realize it was possible to overcome their own struggles. Marie Curie was not only the first woman to receive a degree in physics, she also expressed frustration that many of her experiments ended in failure. However, she wouldn't stay down for too long, but rather focused on solving challenges and learning from her mistakes. Michael Faraday made immense contributions to our understanding of electricity, but most of his peers were university educated and from the upper class, while Faraday was from a poor background and part of a religious minority. Even the great Albert Einstein, considered the father of modern physics, had challenges. Growing up, he saw his father struggle to provide for the family, and to find work, they had to move several times. Einstein often felt out of place, and it was hard for him to catch up on what his new class was working on. Success feels great, but what does it take to get there? Talent? Hard work? No scientist succeeds without struggle. It is the building block of success. So recognize it, embrace it, and most importantly, learn from it. So, tell me again, what does a scientist look like?